Transport Minister Martin Pakula says facing a grilling over Mikey is nothing compared to the pressure on sale of the century. As Jacqueline Freegard discovered, he won $60,000 worth of cash and prizes when he appeared on the quiz show more than 12 years ago. Transport Minister Martin Pakula is certainly used to high pressure situations, but he says that's nothing compared to this. Well, our first challenger tonight is an industrial officer who enjoys watching gangster films. From Elwood in Victoria, please welcome Martin Pakula. The contestant on Sale of the Century in 1998, Pakula slayed the competition during the Mad Minute and the Fame Game over three nights, taking home more than $60,000 worth of cash and prizes, including a lawnmower and a boat. What type of entertainer is colloquially a hoofer? Martin. Singer? Dancer. Which sport competes? This week he returned to Studio 9 to relive his secret quiz show past. Just lo loving the button. Just loving the button. And he says he has no regrets. I was getting a bit of grief at work uh, before I went on, people saying that I was a bit of a, you know, a dork and a loser for going on sale of the century. When I came back the next day and when I came back the next day and told them I picked up a boat and 60 grand worth of prizes, they shut up. Among the items the Minister won on the show was this necklace. It's allegedly worth $15,000, but he has tried to sell it a few times over the years and there haven't been any takers. And there was just one more tough question for old time's sake. How are you going to fix Mikey? Oh, hang on, sorry, that's from his <laughs> hypothetical. Where did that come from? Hard work, persistence and optimism. Jacqueline Frigard, Nine News.